So Buck now finishes out the weekend with two wins in the Lehigh Valley. He last night against Lehigh, tonight against Lafayette. The Bison taking this matchup in four sets. Recapping what we've seen in this one with the first set, seeing Lafayette start off on the right foot, but then Buck now eventually take control. They were just sharper in attack early on and overcame that early run from Lafayette to take the first set 25-17. They saw Sidney Schaefer and Kat Jamison play good again in attack to help set the tone in that first set. Then in the second, Lafayette had as much as a 19-13 lead. Their block helping out along the way, but it was Bucknell finishing out that set on a 12-4 run, and they took the set 25-23, and that was the defining stretch of this match. But it was not without a fight from Lafayette in the third set. They had 22 kills as a team. They saw Kyrie Lichny come on, Ali Fezko as well, combining for eight kills. They would hang tough and eventually take the third set 25-21 and force a fourth set, but this one quite frankly dominated by the Bison. Just too much of the visitors late in this one and despite an early back and forth as the set went on, it was all Bucknell and 25-13 in the fourth set to take the match three sets to one as we look at the Stats in this one, it was at one point dominate in terms of Bucknell kills, then even it finished 52-49. Both teams performed well defensively with, as you see, a combined 157 digs over the four sets. So well played overall. It was just more consistent on the Bucknell side, and that's why they took three of the four sets. Individual leaders in this one. There's a lot to mention in a dramatic four sets, we mentioned what Jordan Harding did a lot. We mentioned what Kat Jamison did a lot. But let's throw out a lot of respect for what Callie O'Connell did with the 43 assists. Bree Frazzles, we mentioned that she had the last three kills of the match to finish with a match high 12. On the opposite side, Abby Naporti with 10 kills. But let's give a shout out to Katie Weston. You see those 19 digs. That was in three sets. She didn't play in the first set. There was a libero change. She helped out the defense a lot better over the final three sets. But that'll do it here from Kirby Sports Center. And the final score in favor of Bucknell, three sets to one. I'm Adam Dubrovoski reminding you that all games airing on the ESPN networks are streaming live and archived on the ESPN app. This has been the presentation of ESPN. Thank you so much for tuning in this evening.